So what was it like last night seeing that name pop up out here on the field? Uh, it was an unbelievable feeling. It's Honestly, it's one of my first times being here, so uh, just having the chance to even get there is um, just unbelievable. I heard you talking earlier. You were so excited you couldn't hardly sleep. I mean, have you ever been that excited before for a, for a particular game? Uh, me as well as my team are just really passionate about everything we do, and um, I've, I get very excited and very uh, anxious when we when we do big things, and this is one of those times where it was just kind of surreal, I guess. As your coach, this the the all the SEC teams making it into the tournament. Why do you think it was that that happened, that, that all 13 were able to make it in? Uh, I'm pretty biased, but the SEC is definitely one of the best conferences to be in, and it definitely hosts the best teams. So I think that's one of the reasons why all 13 made it. I mean, we're the, like I said, we're the best conference in the USA. So. Now, have you been in the NCAA tournament before? Uh, no, sir. Okay. I have not. So the, I was asking her the familiarity of just having gone to OU this year and played Tulsa. How much do you think that helps when you're going into an unfamiliar environment like the NCAA tournament? Uh, I give. I think it gives us a sense of com- comfortability just because we're familiar with our opponents. Um, that doesn't mean to count them out at all. They're both great teams, but it just gives us a sense of familiar, familiarity um, in the situation. What would you say Nicole has added, or not added, but, but what she's meant to your team this season? Uh, Nicole's a great uh, part of our team. You know, she's helped with the long ball. She's helped with batting. She's helped in the field. She's just kind of an all-around player, and she's very, very helpful to us. She's at the home run record. How happy were you all for her? Uh, we were so proud. Um, she's, like Coach Dyfel said earlier, she's so deserving. She works very hard, and I'm happy to call her up, my teammate. You have a couple of fifth-year seniors on your team that have been in the NCAA tournament. Have they kind of given you all pointers of what it's like and everything like that? Uh, <laughs> our fifth years are definitely the, the group that holds us down. Um, me, myself, uh, the rest of the team, we all get super pumped, but they kind of just have a feeling of that they've been there before, you know. And it's it's really nice to have that anchor almost. Courtney said she was confident that you were going to get in. Were, were the players confident, or was it a little nerve-wracking last night? Uh, I think from the beginning of the year, the team just had an overall expectation that we were going to make it to postseason. Like she said earlier, we have a special group of girls, and we're all very competitive. And, you know, we know where we want to end up in NCAA tournament, and past that is one of those expectations. But last night, was it nerve-wracking? Uh, yes and no. Uh, like I said, it was one of my first experiences, so I didn't know what to expect. And... Um, and seeing the name pop up was just like a, a weight lifted off our shoulders, kind of. You guys watched it here on the field, right? Yes, sir. It was a cool moment. Yeah. Just the expectations now that you're in um, as you face Tulsa, a team that you split with this year. Uh, Tulsa's a great team, and we just have to bring our A game. And um, Like Coach Steifel said earlier, their, their pitching is great. They're a great team. We just have to come out firing on all c- cylinders. How much confidence do you guys have, even with some of those – end of the season struggles losing you know three in a row there how much confidence do you have heading into the region uh, we're a very confident team overall you know we we're confident in our abilities and we're confident in our talents and we work hard every day to make sure that uh it's a it's a great season and our coaches do a great job of preparing us every day day in and day out long, the long ball's been big for you guys this year as a team uh, how critical could that be for you guys here in the postseason uh yes yeah, so the long ball has been a big deal but um uh, I wouldn't say that we live on live and die off the, the long ball, but it will definitely help in s- some situations. What do you remember about Tulsa? Uh, I just remember them being a pretty strong team all around. Um, they're, like I said earlier, they're just someone that we have to be on our A game at all times. We can't take them for granted. 